how you can on eBay check like iCloud lock devices and like anything, but you can like if people say that it could be iCloud locked or could it be not, or, like um you can still check it um using the IME num IME I number on the bottom of the iPhone as you can see. Now if the um IME I IME I number is not clear, you can ask uh, you can like uh ask them to like so what IMEI number is, is on the iPhone is six below on the iPhone six and below you'll be able to look on the IMEI number at the back. iPhone six S isn't up, you could ask them to be on the SIM tray. But yeah, and like so yeah. Anyways guys, as you can see we're taking a look on this iPhone 5 S and we're checking the iCloud is if it is on or off. As you can see guys, we're going to go on to check iCloud status and as you can see, I've already put the IMEI number from this phone. Now I've had this before, with SIM trays or like, with SIM trays it might show actually the different IMEI number than what on the phone it is. Because I've had one with the SIM tray which was actually like iCloud unlocked, it was like iPhone 6s but when I used to test it then just literally was iCloud locked so yeah be careful um, anyways as you can see guys I've just put in the thing and if it says this capture response not passed I'm just going to just click load again until it should uh, load and in and show you the iCloud status of the phone you can also check blacklist you can also check the IMEI and this works for both um, I um, iCloud like uh, IMEI and serial number as you can see guys find my iPhone is on and yeah so that's how you do I don't know if by the it works but like if I mean yeah so as you can see guys this just finished and yeah there you go so anyways guys, thank you for watching and we'll see you later.